There are four countries that make up the United Kingdom, also called the UK for short. The four countries are England, Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland. England, Scotland and Wales are all joined on one island, which together is called Great Britain. England, Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland together become the UK. And the British Isles are all the islands put together, which include England, Scotland, Wales, Northern Ireland and Southern Ireland. Each country in the UK has its own flag. The United Kingdom also has its own flag. It is called the Union Jack. The Union Jack is made by joining the four flags together. It's a union, which means joined together of all the four countries, England, Scotland, and Northern Ireland. But what about Wales? Well, the Union Jack was created in 1606. At the time, Wales was part of England, so it wasn't recognized as a separate country. Even though things have changed today, the Union Jack still represents the whole of the UK. England has borders with Wales and Scotland. The capital city of England is London. London is home to many famous landmarks such as the Tower of London, Big Ben, the Houses of Parliament and the Shard. It's where you'll find Buckingham Palace, which is the official home of the British monarch, either a king or queen. England has a government, which is led by the Prime Minister. The government here is called the Government of the United Kingdom. The Prime Minister has a group of people working with him called the Cabinet. They are all members of Parliament and together decide the laws for the rest of the UK. The national flag is called the St George's Cross and people of England speak English. Much of the UK has low hills and plains, especially in central and southern England. In the north, it's more mountainous as England reaches Scotland. The highest peak is Scaffold Pike in the Lake District. As well as the famous landmarks in London, England is home to the Angel of the North, Stonehenge, Durdle Door on the Jurassic Coast and Windsor Castle. Scotland is the most northerly part of the UK. The capital city of Scotland is Edinburgh. You might have heard of Edinburgh Castle, which is one of the most famous castles in the world. Edinburgh is also home to the Scottish Parliament, which makes decisions on how the country is run. The UK government in London controls things like Scotland's defence, foreign affairs and immigration rules, and the Scottish Parliament decides their health, law and education. The national flag is called the Saltier and the people of Scotland speak English and Scottish Gaelic. Like Edinburgh, the city of Glasgow is in the south of Scotland, where they have easy connections to the rest of the UK. In the north of Scotland, you'll find the Highlands. It's more open here with large mountains, valleys and lakes. Here you will find the highest mountain in the UK, Ben Nevis. Further north is the Shetland Islands. There is a total of 100 islands, but only 16 have people living on them. The lakes in Scotland are called lochs. One of the deepest lochs is called Loch Ness, which attracts many people each year, all looking for the Loch Ness monster that they believe lives there. Hello. Other landmarks in Scotland include the Glenfinnan Viaduct, which you might remember seeing in the Harry Potter movies. There's also the Kelpies, Stirling Castle, and the Calanay's Standing Stones. Wales is located in the west of England. The capital city of Wales is Cardiff in the south of Wales. When Wales first joined the Union, it was ruled by England. 
now Wales has some power to decide the running of the country. The government in Wales is called the Welsh Assembly. They can make decisions on health, education and the environment. The national flag is called Fly Gorch, meaning Red Dragon, and the people of Wales speak English and Welsh. Snowdonia National Park is located in the north of Wales. It is home to the highest mountain in Wales called Snowdon. Other landmarks in Wales include Carnarvon Castle, Pontcysute Aqueduct, and in Cardiff, the Wales Millennium Centre. Ireland is made up of two countries, the Republic of Ireland and Northern Ireland. Dublin is the capital of the Republic of Ireland and Belfast is the capital of Northern Ireland. The Republic of Ireland is in the south and it's an independent country and therefore not part of the UK. The government in Northern Ireland is called the Northern Ireland Assembly. Their parliament buildings are in the capital, Belfast. They decide laws on housing, employment, education, health, agriculture and the environment. The flag for Northern Ireland is called St. Patrick's Saltire and the people of Northern Ireland speak English and Irish. The hills around the capital Belfast are said to resemble a sleeping giant. Because of this landscape, Northern Ireland attracts clouds, so it gets less sunshine and more rain than other parts of the UK. The giant causeway can be found in Northern Ireland. It's a group of hexagonal volcanic rock columns forming stepping stones going into the sea. And if you travel to Belfast, you can visit the Titanic Belfast, which is the site where Titanic was designed, built and launched.